first time I saw her. Time stood still. She was the most beautiful thing I had ever seen. Like an angel visited me from heaven. Days went by and all I could think about was her. I'd walk around the city just trying to find her. I ended up giving up. I never thought I'd see her again. But then it happened. There she was, as beautiful as ever. Hi. Hello. Um, is anyone sitting here? Just you. I was so confused. I didn't know what I did wrong, but I wouldn't give up. I figured if she went there for coffee once, she'd go again. And by God, there she was. Hi again. Oh God. Before you say anything, I just want to say that you are the most beautiful person that I have ever seen. I can't believe I'm saying this. You, I saw you once in the street, and you were absolutely stunning. I, all I could think about was how much I wanted to talk to you and how much I wanted to get to know you, but I, I can't believe I'm doing this. I just wanted to tell you how much, how I'm feeling, and holy crap, you smell good. I, uh, your, your hair is beautiful, by the way, and I'm saying too much now, but I just can't. Hey, I just probably get, hey, sit down. <coughs> so, who are you, stranger? Um, I'm David. David. Uh, David. Probably David. David Williams. Yes. Yeah. Hi, David Williams. I'm Karen. Uh, I thought to myself, that's a perfect name. We were a hit. We talked for hours and hours. We became close. We went everywhere together. We did everything together. Achieved everything together. I already knew she was the love of my life. We were inseparable. How's, uh, how's the pizza? It's fine. What's wrong, Karen? David, I... You know, you know what, save it. All right, I've been waiting to tell you this news all day. It means a lot to me, you know? My work is transferring me. I'm getting a bigger payroll and a better position. And I... I want you to come with me. I can't move with you. What? Why? I mean, come with me, please. David, I can't move with you. I don't even know where you're going. I just extended my hand out to you, offering you to come with me. And Which is something I never do. You still haven't told me where we're going. And you haven't told me why. Look, it's not a smart decision. I can't do that to my family. I'll have no job. I can't even believe you'd have the audacity to ask me such a question. Do you really feel that way? Karen, I've put everything into our relationship. I've lost my friends, my family, and even my jobs. Karen, I love you, and I just thought maybe, just maybe, you would come with me on this adventure. But no! Tell me why! 
No, I... Are, are you having an affair with me? I mean, no, absolutely. Is there something I did wrong? No. I mean, then what is it? Just tell me why, Karen. Tell I'm me. I'm pregnant. I understand no, if you- No, 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 no. Could not be more happy right now. Karen, we're having a baby. But you have that new job promotion. Oh, forget about it. I'll tell him I'll keep my job here. I'm thrilled. Thrilled, Karen. That night that she told me that we were having a child was the greatest news I'd ever heard. We ended up growing old together playing cards in the morning, we're watching the news in the afternoon, and we'd laugh. Oh boy, could we make each other laugh. My favorite thing, though, is that we dance every day. Oh, it's... Oh, time for supper. Hey, kiddo, ask your grandma what she would like. Grandpa, grandma passed away. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>